Hey Kwame, this is the latest regarding the coronavirus. What we know that over 90,000 people are now infected globally and there are 158 cases in the U.S. There are also reports that the virus has now mutated. As the coronavirus evolves, we are learning more almost daily, but there's still so many questions. We know how to reduce our risk of contracting the virus, but are we saying and doing enough for those most at risk? Like the elderly, the very young children, and those who already have another illness or compromised immune system. Have we had those conversations with our children, particularly our younger children, the very young and, and not so very young, who may need daily reminders? We have to be vigilant and make sure that those caring for our elderly or those in fragile health are consistently using best practices. For all of these things to happen in an orderly and meaningful way, consider developing a family plan. If someone in your family becomes infected with the coronavirus, what will you do? How do things change in your family? Can you telework? Can your child be homeschooled if their school is still open? Who will prepare meals, do the laundry, walk the dog? Don't panic, be prepared. Have a family meeting, assign tasks, connect with extended family and neighbors and see how you can support each other. We are all in this together. Back to you, Kwame. There you have it, protect yourself, protect your family. Hey, that my friends is our always real talk moment of the day. If you like what you heard, go to our YouTube channel and click subscribe.